Hey, welcome back to another quick tutorial. Now we're going to go over setting a avatar's shader to a different shader on import and after import uh, for those that want to use other shaders on their avatar. Well, let's get started. We're going to hop over into Smooth POV. In Smooth POV here, I'm going to open up my um, dash and you'll see here I'm in a folder called Akita. This is the Akita model from Zab. Zab is a very good avatar creator. Check a link in the video description for a link to Zab's Sketchfab. So I'm going to double click on Akita, set 3D model regular. Auto Humanoid Height, Advanced Settings, and then this is where you can change the material type or the shader type that you want the avatar to be in. Um, if you are confused about that, there is a more longer form tutorial on how to import an avatar. This is just a quick one to update for the material types. So you can scroll through the material types here and find what you're looking for. Usually people go for PBS or they go for a Toon Shader. If you're looking for a Toon Shader, you're looking for Zixi's Toon Shader. So there's Zixi's Toon Shader, and then we can hit Run Import, and then it'll import with all of the shaders on that model being uh, 60s Toon Shader, all the materials having that shader. Additionally, once the model is imported, you can also change the uh, shader of the uh, model using the material tooltip. And that's what we're gonna do immediately once this spawns in. So once this spawns in, I'm gonna go ahead and aim at the avatar's head, hit secondary, and then I'm gonna hit uh, edit to prove that it's 60s. So here we are, 60s Toon Material. And then I can open up the radial menu here and go to convert to, and I can choose any other shader here, including Zixi's Toon Shader. So if I wanted to, I could change this um, avatar to be a PBS um, Veroni Crystal. And then there you go. Now that is a Veroni Crystal avatar. If you're looking for more information about um, textures or styling or material coloring, please check video description for lots more videos on this. This is purely just how to change the shader. I'll see you again next time. Bye-bye.